Nathan Hilton and I'm the Director of Coaching at Nova Centurion Swim Club. So I've been coaching probably 16 or 17 years now. I've only been at Nova Centurion for the last kind of just over 12 months now. Highlights during my coaching career, I've um, I coached a girl to, um, back in 2010 to win European Junior Championships. She won that by 13 one-hundredths of a second. And then the year after in 2011, um, she won World Junior Championships as well. So my group, so I'm uh, responsible mainly for the national and international swimmers and in my group there's probably about anywhere at uh, any one time probably anywhere between 15 and 20, 20 kids. We have three sites, we have one in Nottingham, one in Mansfield and one in Bassett Law um, and I'm obviously mainly responsible for Nottingham but I oversee Mansfield and Bassett Law as well. The whole programme's got about 330 kids in and at Nottingham we've got about 100, it's anywhere between 100 and 120 at any one time. So in terms of what they're doing now, so I, I like to, um, so we've done a, a, a stressful maximum kick set um, and off the back of that, normally on a Wednesday evening, we'll do um, some fly development work. So I, what, what I'm really aiming for them to do is, is make sure that we've, we've put them under a stressful situation and now we're trying to develop their fly swing. It's probably the most technically difficult stroke. And what I've done is put them under pressure on their kick and then I'm trying to make sure they're holding their form together as they go into doing some fly so and it's more based around trying to develop the swimmers that do 200 fly but also the key, key event that we'll do is 200 and 400 medley and fly is obviously the first leg of that so they've got to be efficient at their fly to make sure the other strokes in their medley don't suffer so I'll put them under pressure in terms of the kick set and then they've got to step up and do some fly work after as well so it's quite a, a stressful, stressful set for them. I'm Josh Stevenson Ganner. I've been swimming Nova Centurion about four or five years now. But I've been a member for quite a while. I did learn to swim obviously for about a year and then my teacher or coach at that time said I can't really teach you anymore so I suggest you join a club. So I joined a club after that and then you know I, f I felt I was alright at it and it kind of just inevitably just stuck. I ended up not doing anything else. It just, I don't know, I just, just seemed like the, the right sport for me. So. At the moment, I train about 10 times in the pool. Uh, I do a gym session on a Monday and a Friday, and then I do gym with the rest of the team on a Tuesday. Uh, we do a little bit on a Wednesday, and then some after the session on a Thursday as well. So it's, it's pretty full time. I mean, it, it, you know. You can't really be doing much of anything else. You've really got to stick to most of it. I mean, because swimming's usually train early in the morning and then late at night. It does gives you a lot of time during the day to do the rest of other things. But most of the time, it's just it's, it's pretty full on. You know, it takes up a lot of time. And you get like uh, invited to parties on a Thursday and stuff. You can't do it because you've got to go training Friday morning. So you can't be staying up till one o'clock at a party or twelve o'clock because you know you've got to get up again the next day. Uh, school was, you know, it's quite a big sacrifice. I mean, because you obviously have to shift your attention on one thing or the other. You gain so much from from swimming in terms. Of you get a whole different set of friends that you see ten times a week, and that you spend literally most of your time with, if not all of your time. If I if I can get to representing my country, I think that would be that would be amazing. I mean, I think that's a good goal. It's quite plausible as well. I think it's achievable. Anything to do with that would be good. I mean, as high as I can possibly go, hopefully. I'm Morgan and uh, swim for Nova and I'm 15 years old. At the moment I'm on the transition from age group up into youth. And my dad just said I'll oh, go try swimming and kind of stuck from there really.
Chelsea Campbell, I'm 17. Um, I've been a swimmer since I was about seven years old, I think. Uh, swam on Nova since I was about nine. I'm a full-time student at the moment at Philpott College, swimming A-levels. I've changed quite a lot since I was younger. Um, when I was quite young, I was, I was rubbish at anything over 50 metres. I was one of those kids so I couldn't really swim um, for very long distances. But um, as I kind of progressed through, um, I kind of changed from a breaststroker to a fly swimmer. So I started to swim 200 fly. Um, this was when I was about 13, 14. And then, um, then I got injured. Um, actually quite a young age to be fair uh, and I'm just kind of like getting back into it now.